Hello, protea lovers. Today I'm sharing a beautiful Banksia, a Banksia birthday candles. Banksias are from Australia, while proteas are from South Africa. They're both very closely related. I bought this plant a couple years ago from the UC Santa Cruz Arboretum. It came in a one gallon pot. It was maybe six inches tall. I now have it in a seven gallon pot. And, and it's been a couple years, and as you can see now, it has a number of beautiful blooms. I have a couple plants in the ground and they are not blooming. I'm not sure why the one in the pot is blooming. As you can see, the blooms are a beautiful yellow color. Here's a close-up of some of the flowers. Here's another angle of the beautiful flowers. Here's a view from the top of the plant. This comes in other variety of colors. Here's another Banksia birthday candles that I planted in the ground. It's growing really well. As you can see, there are no blooms. Here's a second birthday candles that I planted, and again, no blooms, but uh, growing very well. This is a Banksia spinulosa that I grew from seed that I put in the ground maybe three years ago, and it's now sending up a flower. Uh, this plant is related to the birthday candles, but as you can see, it's a much bigger plant. Here's a close-up of the flower bud. The flower is just forming. Probably has another month before it's fully opened. Here's one of my favorite Banksias, Banksia grandis. This is a dwarf version. I purchased this plant also from the UC Santa Cruz Arboretum. I have it growing in a 15 gallon pot. This plant has one of the most beautiful leaf patterns I've ever seen. It's yet to bloom, but hopefully in the next year or two it will bloom. Here's a close-up of the leaf pattern. So to conclude, if you ever get a chance to buy Banksia birthday candles, I highly suggest it. Very easy plant to grow, very beautiful and unusual flowers. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe. Thanks.